Hello guys, welcome back to my channel. Today we're going to, we're going to be talking about the most, one of the most common flutter errors, the most common flutter layout errors, and that will be a render render flex overflow. Render X overflow is one of the most frequently encountered flutter framework errors, and you may you you probably have run into it it already and when this error happens uh, you probably see black stripes indicating the area of overflow in the app UI as you see here in our app here our text loading ipsum is underlined with the white with yellow stripes and also on addition we'll be having an error in your debug console it's exception code by rendering library the following a sensation was thrown during the layout render x overflow by 6267 pixels on the right as you see it here um, this error often occurs when a column or a row has a child widget that is not constrained in its size uh, let's go let's look at our code that is causing this as you see here we are having a row as the first child of the container and also a column as the second child of the row for example uh, as you see in our code uh, as you see uh, the column tries to be wider than the space the row can allocate it causing an overflow causing an overflow error in our UI and why does the column try to do that? Because, as you see, to understand why it is doing that, you need to know the, how the Flutter framework performs layout. You need to know how Flutter framework performs the layout. So, uh, in the short, to perform layout, Flutter walks the render tree in the depth first traverse and passes downsize constraint from the parent to the child. So children respond by passing up a size to their parent object within the constraint constraints the parent establishes so to know more about that maybe you need to read about the flat architecture overview one of their documentation that explains the flat architecture so uh, in this case uh, the raw widget is not constraining the size of its children know that the column widget so lacking constraint from its parent widget uh, the second text widget tries to be as wide as all the characters it needs to display as you see the second widget which is this text it has a wider text so it tries to be wide as it can so that it can display all the text but then so uh, the self -determ determined Determine the width of the text widget of this text widget loading with some dollar seat amid it, it then gets adopted by the column which crashes with the maximum amount of horizontal space its parent the row widget can provide which is this widget here so um, in short in short, the text widget is trying to consume more space in order to display its text to the fullest while crashing maximum amount of horizontal space its parent, the column, can provide with and provide it with so hence leading to this error you're seeing here as you see the word volume ipsum is trying to go to be on the same line on one line trying to consume to display horizontally but remember this is a, a small screen of, a, fo of a, a phone so it crashes with the, the the maximum amount of horizontal space its parent the row can provide hence causing this error you're seeing here and now in this video let's try to fix this error I'm going to show you how we can quickly fix this error so that next time you can avoid it 
in case you you're designing your UI, you make sure you always avoid this kind of doing things. So uh, we need to make sure this column cannot intend to be wider than it is expected. To achieve this, you need to constrain its width. One way to do it is to wrap the column in an expanded widget. So let's wrap our column in an expanded widget. Uh, control, control that. Let's wrap it in an expanded widget. Okay, it's not here. Let's just wrap it to widget. Okay, so expanded widget. Expanded. Okay, after wrapping it in an expanded widget. Now let's, let's run, run our code, let's save and run our code, performing all the world complete, okay, as you see now, it's kind of like coming up, so now here, let's wrap this container under the scaffold too, because this is not good practice, to start with the container and the menu one. the container be the border let's wrap the container into a center widget let's save that as you see the error is gone completely We have now we are not having any more errors as you see let's check the debug console everything looks good and there is a there would be another way to fix this another way would be like instead of using expanded widget we can wrap the column with the with the flex widget. Let's try it flex. Flexible widget. Save that. All good. Everything looks to be fine. No more errors. The okay, guys. That's how you can solve a, a render flex overflow flutter layout error this error is all, so much common so anyway so i had to do a video about it to help those that are around getting it in case you have this kind of error this is the, this is the way to fix it so thank you guys for watching please subscribe bye bye